The House of Wayward Plants, the Smithfield Greenhouse, was a commission for Culture Mile within Smithfield's Rotunda Garden. The design takes its inspiration from the ironwork of Smithfield Market, Victorian plant explorers, and an eccentric craze that swept the country known as Terradomania or Fern Fever. In summer 2019, the Smithfield Rotunda Garden became a local hub for activities, hosting events such as botanical collage and drawing workshops, classes about mini beasts and plant adoption events as part of a wider project called the House of Wayward Plants, where thousands of plants in need of a good home are put up for adoption every year. Ferns are a group of vascular plants. They don't have flowers or seeds but have wonderful fronds and they release tiny spores. Ferns exist all over the planet, from the Arctic to the deep tropical jungles, from the incredibly hardy to the remarkably delicate. They are some of the oldest plants in existence, and as a result, there is an estimated 10,500 species around the world. Their complexity and variety have led them to have become one of the most desirable and collectible plants, something which led to the outbreak of fern fever. This mania for collecting ferns gripped the Victorians for nearly 50 years. An interesting social leveller back when classism was rife, fern collecting was something that could be done by anyone, with the UK having just as many rare and unusual species as other exotic countries. Having intrepidly collected ferns, the Victorians needed somewhere to keep, study and admire their collections, and the Wardian case was born, the forerunner to the modern terrarium. Fern fever prompted much exploration of the countryside, with many enthusiasts and intrepid explorers hunting for rare species. The exploration occasionally went a step too far, in one case leading Miss Mary Jane Myers falling 170 feet off a cliff to her death. Many a cliff was scaled and ravine descended in pursuit of ferns, often leading to accidents or more fatal outcomes. The Smithfield Greenhouse has now moved on to a new home in Mordenhall Park, where it continues to support community growing. If you think you have a modern case of fern fever, then let us know. Tag your favourite fern photos from your verdant homes and gardens so that we can see what all you terridomaniacs are up to.